Hey, welcome back, everybody. Sign here again with what's probably the finale of uh, Stone Block 3. And got everything running here. Except for this system over here, which this is our infinite ingots, and I missed one here. Ooh. Uh, this guy? Yep. Yeah. There we go. All right, we're all set. We just need to give this thing some rotational energy now. Overstressed, overstressed. Bingo. There we go. And now we're auto crafting infinite ingots. Now this one's going to have to run 11 times for every time this one runs. So. But we're doing doing okay-ish for now. Uh, this one actually ran by itself for quite a while, and uh, so we're, we got a backlog on this, which is good because this is the slowest of the crafters right now. Although, actually, this one will be slowest once it burns through the backlog of the uh, Infinity Catalysts. And I just got a stick. There we go, and I finally decided to start using this thing again. I figure it's it's the last episode I can go back to using the uh the overpowered handheld thing. Alright. But if we come over here I've got everything set up to make a transmutation tablet. Alright, and transmutation on the go. I had to make another one of these tables here. Which uh, let me go ahead and empty this out. Yep. Did you ever Oh, yeah, Avarita, or... Yeah, Avarita is what is the 9x9. Nine nine. It's a... It's got some issues right now, I think. There it goes, finally. And we ended up getting two of these things, so... Delete. And now I want to go to my machine room. And it's going to get loud here in a second. There we go. 400 million. Thank God I choose the, chose the fastest. Why did one of the lasers just cut off? Are we out of... What the heck is going on? No, we're not out of power. Why are the lasers... Oh, the lasers are just not rendering. Oh, okay. You can see the energy still going up. Weird. Why did the render thread cut off on those? No idea. Uh, but yeah, that's my nitro crystal crafter right here. So it's got three of the uh, the energizing rod nitros on it. Almost there though. And now it's gonna get loud. No, actually, I there's still a quest left, huh? What is? What have I not done? Oh, the Arcane Transmutation Tablet. So I need four alchemy tables. I need an alchemical chest, two philosopher stones. That's not going to be difficult to make. I'll probably pull that off right here, actually. So, oh, except for one thing. I need another one of these. Portable transmutation tablet with built-in crafting functionality. Uh, let me go back. And... Go ahead and teach that. Hey, we learned everything. Um, right. Well, there's the transmutation table. Does the tablet not have a uh, an EMC? It does. Uh, wow. Okay. That's a 1.9 billion <laughs> EMC. Okay, we're not cheesing that in. How many infinite ingots do we have now? 
We're up to 38. And we got 33 silverfish hearts. Okay. So I need, was it seven wool and a crystal matrix block for the bow? So, yeah, I'm just going to auto-complete this. It was so nice whenever JEI and REI added functionality for that, for the auto-complete. Hey, there it goes. All right, let's go ahead, though, and we're going to claim this. Sigil of the Fast Miner. Okay. Sigil of the Frozen Lake. Wow. Getting a lot of blood magic sigils now. But we got Longbow of the Heavens, anyway, which is under the Ultimate Armor tab. Add on range tier 10. Alright, so I need a red matter shovel. Which I don't think I have. Red matter axe. Red matter pick. And red matter sword. And then I need my gem armor, which we have made for a quest anyway. Never used it. Uh, that is down here. I have it sitting on an armor stand right now. There's that. Let's go ahead and put you away because, yeah, don't need that. And these guys are going to be kind of spendy. I need a good amount of neutronium for these. Now I'll go ahead and make the red matter tools off camera because the, uh, let's go ahead and go here, here. Red matter is made dark matter and mechanical crafter, and then this is made a mechanical crafter as well. So... Um, we need, wow, we're almost out of Neutronium already. Yeah. Oh, and these actually require two catalysts. Okay. Which I am now out of because of the set up to autocraft. Um, do you, you need one says what, three? So I need three ultimate cattle or infinite catalysts. Okay. Rob those from there real quick. All right, so Jim Helmet. Jim Boots. I'm missing an infinity ingot already. Okay. Missing six, and I need two matrix blocks for that. Okay. How about you? You don't have any matrix blocks. Okay. Why are the pants so difficult to make? Well, difficult. No, why do they have the uh, most different types of ingredients to them? We need six more for that, and then we need like 14 more for that. I was hoping to at least get two pieces of armor done. Is it plus 1,000 knockback resistance? And it gives me night vision. All right, well, I managed to get the infinity armor made up anyway. And we're fast. Didn't these have at one point in time, like, yeah, plus standing speed? Yeah, that, that's not that fast, right? This is my run speed. I remember them being a lot quicker than that in the past. All right. Um, I went ahead and got the red matter tools made up as well. Pretty certain I don't have enough ingots yet made. Yeah, that took 18 ingots just for the pick. Oh. I didn't do autocomplete. But, world breaker. Give it a sec. There it goes. Now it detected. Now it's emptied. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're down to five 
ingots again. All right, let's see, what do we get for the helmet? Frozen Lake. Ultimate pipe upgrades. Blue bomb. Some supplementaries. And brown laser lens. Just one. And then our pick got us what? An elytra. Okay, well, I mean, that's the thing. Oh, what was the loop B over there? Now, I'm going to have to probably pass, I think, on the Arcane Transmutation tablet because I need another tablet. I don't have the EMC for this, and I'm going to have to make a bunch more singularities to get more Infinity Ingots because I didn't realize I had to make two of these tablets. I really shouldn't have deleted the duped one in. <laughs> really should not have deleted that one. Oh, well. What are you going to do, right? You know something I haven't checked in a while? How's my red matter production back here doing? Uh, we have seven. We've got a bit. Oop. I just picked up nuggets of experience. I've got a stupid amount of those now. So let's go ahead and drop our red matter off in here. And there we got 200 million. Uh, do I have like a good amount of any other? Oh, oh yeah, no, we're fine. I've got the EMC. I forgot I made like so much of this stuff extra. There we go. And we can grab ourselves. Where did my clan star go? Oh, it's right here. Okay. I didn't even see it. Uh, transmutation tablet. There we go. Oh, this thing's full, actually. Huh. Star iron, I guess, is the best I can get. Okay. I mean, I could dump a bunch more matter in. Uh, let's see. So you, I need like six of these. Five, six. Alchemical chest, good. Crafting table. So I just need these. Oh, I don't have torches in my system. Shame on me. Now that quest is going to be complete. And we got blue bombs. All right. Cool. Uh, have we got any more ingots in the meantime? No, we have not. Okay. Not much we can do about that, really. Um, Terra Steel, right? Something I can do in the meantime is wrap up the Batania as well. It makes a difference in flying speed, that's for sure. Now, I could wait for the Sword of the Cosmos for this, but uh, the Gaia Guardian's got a damage cap that it can take for hit to keep it from one-shotting it.
There it goes. I was starting to wonder if it was ever actually going to, uh... Plank. Do I need arrows for you? Nope. <laughs> this bow is just insane. I love it. It just kills everything in front of it. Really explosive power. It's great. Thank God it doesn't destroy blocks, though. I love how he actually created a hole up there for himself. I wonder. God, I should just use the bow on him. Alright, so... Gaia Spirit ingots now. Um, do 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 do. Or not Gaia Spirit ingots, but Gaia Spirits that I can turn into a Gaia Spirit ingot. And inventory is still kind of full, but. Gaia Guardian Mark II. Let's go. Oh. Doing his thing now. Downside is, I noticed the explosion from the arrows does destroy drops. But... So we got Willatorag, more spirits, some mana steel, mana pearls. Oh, it's all over here. Okay, it spawns at me, not where he drops. Autumn, Freed, Relic Kate. And we got the Fruit of Grisaia. Cool. That turns mana basically into food you can eat, unlimited food. So at this point, it's just a, honestly a whatever. Uh, let's go to our Batania quest line, though. Basic flux storage. And then I never did claim for the compact machine that I did off camera. Entangled binder. Okay. So let's put that away. Music disc can go away. Rune of water. Flux storage. Tangled Binder. Let's go ahead and put the World Breaker away. I don't think I'm going to need, ever need that. Uh, it does live up to its name, and I don't want to use it around my base. So, yeah. So we're waiting for Infinity Ingots now, then. Actually, what we're waiting on right now is uh, Infinite, or Ultimate Stew. That's the holdup of everything right now. Alright, I think I have everything together now for the last of the stuff. So, the Planet Eater got our infinite shovel. Red Matter Axe is going to become Nature's Ruin. I think we just duplicated some infinity and get. Actually, no, 15 is what I needed. Okay, yeah, that's right. And we needed 15 for the Sword of the Cosmos. And Red Matter Sword goes here. Ultimate Armor Chapter complete. So we have Such the Frozen Lake again. 
Chance Cube, and Sigil of the Green Grove. All right, six Chance Cubes. Oh no, it's one off on my... Uh... Oh, you can't uncraft these things, huh? Huh. It's a good thing I didn't make a ton of them then. No, I'm just going to keep using the Hero Brines. That's only 12 attack damage? Wow, okay. Yeah, no. That's 29 for the axe. And 16 for the shovel, but the sword's only 12. I think it does just one hit kill things, though. So what do we have left for quests? We've got Ars Nouveau, Summon a Familiar. I'm not going to bother with that. And Storage, AE2 stuff. I'm not going to bother with that either. So I think we can call this pack done, actually. But thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I definitely enjoyed the pack. And uh, there was quite a gap in the middle of it, but... Uh, kind of events beyond my control at that point. But uh, thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And until the next series, sign signing out. Have fun.